I'm, I'm kind of shook. So stay tuned if you want to see exactly how the coverage looks. And yeah. <laughs> Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. My name is Everything Renee and today I'm doing a review for Il Maquillage. This video is not sponsored but I'm so motherfucking excited because your girl needs a new foundation. Like y'all see this? I'm currently wearing Fenty Beauty in the shade 420 which I think actually might be just a little bit too dark. If this is your first time seeing me and you are new to my channel, please do not forget to subscribe, comment, and like. Let's just jump right into it though. So this is the packaging, which I think is so cute. This is what it looks like. It has the foundation that I got. Also, it came with an ink liner which I just bought one of these from a beauty supply store. Damn. That's okay. We can try this out too. So it says how it works. Number one, try the products. These products are yours to try for 14 days, starting on the day that they were delivered. So it hasn't been 14 days yet. It's probably been about 10 days since I've ordered this. <laughs> the cool thing about this foundation, especially if you haven't ever heard about Il Maquillage, in order to get your color match, all you have to do is answer a few questions. Just based off those questions, they supposedly find your perfect match. So I believe, I don't even remember how many questions it was, but it wasn't that many questions. Um, they threw in some pictures every now and then to compare complexions, I guess, to compare skin tones. It also came with this little card on this card, it shows you different steps you can use to apply the foundation. It does retail for $45, I believe. They have it set up to where you can try the product for 14 days. If you decide that it's not to your liking, then you can always get your money back. Like, yeah, that's what's up. On the inside of the box, it says, sorry, I don't speak low maintenance. Immediately looking at the product, I'm not sure if this is going to fit me. It looks really light in the bottle, so I'm not really sure, but this is what we're here for. Apply two pumps to your entire face. I already had some concealer on my hands from when I did my eyebrows. I ain't trying to waste it, so I'm just gonna put it off to the side, you feel me? Oh, that was three. This is the foundation. This is what I use my concealer for and I also mix this as well. It's close to my skin tone. It just allows my concealer and my application process to blend way more easily when I add that third color. These three colors are actually very similar, but I still think it's too light for my your girl's face. This is what it looks like on the sponge. Here we go. the questions right should I have cheated on the test it also says blend out with a brush or sponge not by hand wait five minutes for foundation to set before checking the shade don't match your neck with don't match your neck or wrist they're a different tone than your face in all my years of makeup artistry I believe you're supposed to match your face with your neck I'm not saying nobody's wrong. I'm just saying. Um, okay. Finish your face with concealer, brush, and bronzer. And then wear for a full week to determine if it's perfect for you. Well, I don't know. I have... It slick looked like it started blending.
I've used all that I have. That was about two, I think that was three pumps. I believe I went for a medium to full coverage. Some days I like my foundation to be a little thick. Some days I don't. Some days I want literally like the bare minimum. Today I'm going for a little more of a full coverage because I want to see. This will be like my second layer of blending really. Am I looking washed out though? Anyway, I'm just gonna trust the process. Just gonna trust the process. Cause at this point, I'm confused. <laughs> I can see it oxidizing. Y'all, what do I look like? Oh my gosh, what the fuck? Am I tripping? Is it blending? Or am I tripping? Is it looking blotchy? Turn the light down. I feel like a fucking mess. I'm coming back. Let me finish my face and get with the program. So far, I'm not liking it, but maybe I need to just trust the process, and, but I'll be right back once my face is complete. Y'all, when I tell you, this, this is like the perfect coverage and Although it doesn't match exactly with my body like I've been doing for years. According to the Il Maquillage checklist, I've been doing this shit wrong. These results, like, look at that. I had to go, I had to do my hair a little bit. Y'all, that's this light. You know what I mean? Like. I look the fuck good. Y'all. Love, I love the coverage. I love that it even kind of filled my pores in a little bit. I didn't use any primer um, with this application. Not only did it change my complexion to where I feel like it needs to be, Like how the fuck is my new skin in a bottle? And I ain't gonna hold y'all, y'all see it. Let me know down below if you think that this is a good match. Look at this coverage. It covers exactly how I like. Oh yeah, also I used the eyeliner. Before I show you guys what it looked like, let me just show you what my line looked like. It's not perfect, cause I actually was rushing. My DoorDash got here and whatnot, but y'all, it dried matte. Don't look at my pores, cause they're looking at you. <laughs> y'all, let me show y'all the tip of it. This how you know it's real. Like, look how, look at the precision on that. Look at that, I barely even touched my, like, what the heck? What? Oh, it's, it's so sharp, like, you can't find none of this in beauty supply, and look how it's, oh my goodness, like. It went on so smooth, super easy to use. I would say you should have a steady hand when using this precision pen, because it does what it's supposed to do, I must say. This is the one I purchased and this is one of the best ones I feel like in my opinion when it comes to a beauty supply drugstore brand. It also has a felt pen. With this wand, 
you can see how much product is on the tip of it which makes it not as precise and your girl appreciates precision okay so thank you so much guys for tuning into my channel i appreciate it comment down below if you like these reviews i like reviews this was a lot of fun so all right guys i will see you on the next video thank you so much for watching bye